And now weather with meteorologist T.J. Springer. Certified by WeatherAid for the most accurate forecast in the Ozarks. We have been keeping tabs on a front across the region. Welcome back. It's 547 on this Thursday, not producing lots of showers or storms, but we can see some cloud cover and we've seen a few sprinkles here this morning, but this is going to hang out to our north and I think it'll be a focal point for a little more storminess as we head throughout the next 24 hours. So we'll get to that in just a moment, but we are still quiet this morning. It's humid out there. It doesn't feel the most pleasant. Here's that live look in Branson. We can see those clouds in the sky glancing eastward and we have some of those in the metro as well. Here's our downtown Springfield camera taking a peek outside your door. We're at 75 degrees. That wind a little lighter from the south with the dew point at 72. The humidity sitting in the low 90s. It is not the nicest start. At least it's dry. But as Jesse mentioned, the AC is a good idea. 76 is the current temp in Harrison and Fort Leonard Wood. We have 75 in Camdenton, so closer to 80 the farther west you live along the I-49 corridor in Tulsa, Oklahoma is sitting in the lower 80s, well above normal. We're back in the lower 90s today, which is also above average. Some spots could get back into the mid 90s, a little more cloud cover thanks to this front on top of us, but we're still not expecting lots of rain. About a 10% chance today. The big story is going to be the heat and the heat index. I think values feels like temps back in the triple digits today, tomorrow, Saturday, but look what's in store. Finally, some relief. Lowered humidity on Sunday. It's still going to be hot above average, but it's going to feel a little bit better and then the heat starts to return in the humidity heading through early next week. Now with the high heat index values that we're expecting today, we do have heat advisories for most of us through this evening with those excessive heat warnings off toward the east for even higher humidity and higher feels like temps. So if you're heading out toward places like St. Louis, be prepared for even steamier conditions. You can see it's not just us either here in the Show Me State, but much of the south in the Ohio Valley as this ridge just dominates our weather pattern here throughout the upper Midwest and the eastern third of the country, really. Now overnight, that's when we do expect the chance for storms to go up. Limited, only about a 10% chance with lows in the lower 70s. I think we're going to keep the threat around tomorrow too, so let's time it out in the future cast. As we head through the remainder of the morning into the early afternoon, we'll call it a mix of clouds and sunshine, partly cloudy out there. Tonight, we start to see this front slowly but surely drift our way, and with it, we're seeing some showers and thunderstorms across central Mo. They continue to slide toward us, but really skimming us. We may see a couple of showers or storms close to Morgan, Miller, Mary's, Phelps, and Dent County from Rolla up through places like Lake Ozark, but we're not going to see much. I do think we're going to stay pretty dry, especially the farther south and west you live. I think our northeastern neighborhoods, a slightly higher chance is expected. We do have that marginal to slight risk, or a one to two out of five on the risk scale meaning a few storms could include some small hail or brief gusty wind. It's not going to be a great chance, but if they can develop because of the instability, we could have a few stronger storms. So make sure you stay weather aware. Our certified most accurate 70 forecast shows that little break in the heat over the weekend. Our Father's Day weekend definitely looking pretty good. Not as humid on Father's Day itself for our dads, which is great, but we are expecting the chance for I should say the likelihood of uh, heat to take back over as we head over uh, through Monday and Tuesday. I think, guys, for the official start to summer, it is definitely going to be a lot warmer. It says steamy on there, actually. Mm -hmm. I put that in there for good measure. <clears throat> steamy. Okay. And yeah. sizzling, too. <laughs> Just had to be sure we knew. Oh, yeah. Highly steamy. Now, okay. let's yeah. check on your.